Hello, welcome to this video on the installation of the Atlas Open Data Virtual Machine. So let's start from our documentation, in this case, to the virtual machine area. The first thing that we need to do is to install, download, and install the VirtualBox. So if you go to the VirtualBox installation, essentially it's a software that will allow you to manipulate more than one virtual machine in your, in your computer. So you can go through this link, official site, or simply type virtualbox.org. So once you land into this page, <clears throat> we'll essentially show you a big button where the latest stable version of this software. You simply click on, on that rectangle, and it will take you to a page where you have to choose um, the application, taking into account your operating system. So for example, I am a Mac user. I will need the OS version. But maybe many of you are Windows users, and you will need to find this link or maybe another distribution of Linux. Match the operating system to, the, the, to this menu and get the right uh, version of the, of the application. So in general, um, depends on your computer, it depends on the internet connection. This can take a few seconds or can take a few minutes. So be patient. Also, uh, if in, I will maybe accelerate a little bit some of this process when, when it's not necessary, let's say, just to wait for the bar to fill. Um, in this case, the virtual, virtual box um, application is already here. I just start the installation. So this application do a little um, verification and after uh, show you the menu to install. Okay. Okay. So when we have this window. We simply double click on the application. We say yes. We simply follow the let's say the standard installation. Say continue, go to install. It may ask you your password or any other way of authentication. Of course, you are installing a new application in your computer. But that's also very important in case you need to install this in more than one computer. Like for example, um, uh, laboratory inside the university, inside your um, <coughs> inside your institution, just to be sure that you have the right to install or to contact the right people to install this uh, this application beforehand. Okay, when the installation is done, we simply close this part. You can remove the slide, let's go. And close this window. So one, we have now little box. Okay, and we can even uh, take a look at this. OK, as you can see, I already have several virtual machines. Not the first time um, I download one in this computer, but it's still not the virtual machine that we want to get today. So let's come back to our documentation. <coughs> OK, so now let's get the virtual machine itself. 